Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching y'all how to make a join and leave voice channel command. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, I basically got this request on my part two video. And so I was like, you know, I'm going to go ahead and reply to it since uh, sometimes that discord.py um, document documentation is a little bit harder to read. So I'm going to be making a little video on it. So basically, uh, this command, the join, you'll just do uh, exclamation join channel. That's why I'm going to have the command. You can really make it whatever. And also make I'll make a leave command because you don't want to be having to disconnect it all the time. Uh, so yeah, I uh, don't really know why you would really need this for. I guess this guy wanted me to make it because he's making a text-to-speech um, Discord bot. So yeah, let's go ahead and get right into it, because uh, Discord documentation can be a little bit hard to understand. Uh, luckily, I understand it. So yeah, let's go and do bot at bot.command. Okay, or if you have it as uh, client.command, then you do client.command. Then we're going to do async diff, and we're going to do join channel. Alright, and then we're going to go ahead and we're going to make it a pass underscore context. And we're going to equal that to true. All right, and then once we've done that, we're going to start off with an if. So, <clears throat> or sorry, I did that wrong. All right, you want to, my bad. CXT needs to be right here. You're gonna end that and then end parentheses right here. You're gonna do the past context, my bad. Now we're gonna start off with an if, if statement. So if CXT.author, okay, author basically means the person whoever um, made this or did the, uh, Command, okay. Um, if CXC author voice, and then we're going to do channel equals, okay. And then we're gonna go ahead and we're going to channel equals CXC dot message dot author author dot voice dot channel. Basically, what the um dot message author so basically the message of the author that said it it's going to gather the voice channel that they're in then we're going to do and then it's going to then we're going to do await channel dot connect okay which is basically going to uh connect to it now now we're going to make it elf or sorry else which basically means let's just say if he's not actually in a voice channel we're going to do await cxt dot sin yeah, which basically means if he's not in there, if uh, voice author is not in voice, then it's going to go ahead and send this message. You are not in a voice channel. Please join one so I can join. You can really make this text whenever you wanted to. I'm just going to go ahead and make it like that, though. All right, now once we have done that, then we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and be testing this. So let's go ahead and run this bot. Boom, and then we're gonna go over to our Discord. And we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna type in exclamation join channel. You're not in the voice channel, all right, so perfect. And then we're gonna go and join this voice channel. Exclamation join channel. And boom, he has automatically joined. Now, obviously, we would have to uh, disconnect him because there's no other way to actually disconnect him. So let's go ahead and change that. So it's not that much harder to uh, do. And it will obviously say it right here, uh, connecting all this blah, 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 blah. Um, so yeah. Now let's go ahead and let's make the uh, leave command. So at bot.command, actually, I'm going to go and uh, organize everything. We're going to do hashtag uh, leave voice channel command now we're going to still paste that same thing the um past contents equals true then we're going to do async diff and i'm going to do leave channel 60. now we're going to oh there we are then we're going to do uh we're going to do another if so if um 60 dot author uh, sorry, not author. Um, sixty uh, voice underscore client. All right, and then we're gonna do um, await sixty dot guild 
dot voice underscore client, and then we're going to do dot disconnect, disconnect, which basically makes it disconnect. So it basically says whatever voice channel you're in, disconnect it, disconnect from it, and then we're going to go ahead and we're going to send a message, which will say I have this uh, disconnected from the voice channel. And then we're going to go and do the else command again. And we're going to go and do await. Await 60.sin. Await 60.sin. There we go. And then we're going to do I am not in a in a voice channel. Boom. So now you're going to, uh, let me see, everything should be correct. So now let's go and run this bot and let's make sure that this is indeed correct. So let's go back over to here, exclamation leave, or sorry, exclamation join ch channel. And before I submit that, I'm gonna go ahead and join general. Let's go ahead and join it and then we're going to make it leave. So exclamation leave channel. And boom, he's left, just like that. So um, now I'm just gonna go ahead and um, add. This is optional, but I'm going to go ahead and add after the connect and be able to uh, do a message. So we're gonna do await cxd.send. I have, oh, I have joined the channel. Now, obviously we couldn't make these into embeds, but this is obviously very pointless. Let's just say if you did though, all you want to do is just replace this await cxd.sin with em equals discord embed, whatever it is, and then add the field and then just say await cxd.sin embed equals em um, if you want to make that. But I'm not going to be doing that in today's video. Uh, Y'all can do that on yourself. But yeah, this bot is basically ready. So let's go and make it join one more time. Uh, join channel. Join channel. There we go. And then I've joined the channel and then leave channel leave channel there we go if i can actually type correctly boom just like that um i oh my gosh i'm gonna go and make it uh, i have joined the voice channel there we go and so yeah that's basically how you do it uh, i will be leaving all the code down in the description again for y'all so yeah uh, if y'all did indeed enjoy this video make sure you like subscribe all that type of stuff if you do have another video idea go ahead, comment it down below and i will maybe take it um into a video or make it into a video so yeah if y'all enjoyed it uh, i'll see y'all in the next video